Happy birthday, beautiful Winona from the wonderful south where it's hot and humid. Um, this is your 90th, a big one. You're just as charming as ever, and I love seeing the videos that the kids, your children, post, and uh, at least we can keep in touch. Uh, fond memories of long ago. Have a wonderful, wonderful day, you beautiful woman. Bye. Hi, Winona. This is Hans. Most likely you will not recognize me because so many years have gone by since we saw each other. We wish you a wonderful, happy and blessed 90th birthday. We will always remember the wonderful years we spent at the New England Sun and especially the wonderful, kind people we worked with. We count those years among the best ones of our life. Again, we wish you a very, very happy birthday in company of your family and God bless you during the new year. We love you. Bye bye. Happy 90th birthday, Winona. It is so nice to be part of the celebrations. We have enjoyed hearing about you from Rondi even before we met you in Arizona, which was a blessing and a privilege. And I can't believe you live here in Lincoln. I love running into you at church. I know that you enjoy the music as much as I do. I love being able to run around with you when Martha's out of town. I think that's great. And especially if Rondi visits, we'll have good times together. You know, Winona, we appreciate you for your friendly ways, your courage to travel the nation, and your zest for enjoying life. I just hope you have a wonderful, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Grandma Nona, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday Grandma Nona from Florida, wish I could be there and I hope you just have a fantastic day. Love you, bye. Hello, hello, I just wanted to add my Happy birthday wishes to Aunt Winona, along with everyone else. It's coming from southern Chile, and it's getting dark, so I can't show you anything. But I do hope you have a wonderful uh, day, and uh, I wish you all the joys of this year to come. And I'm so thankful that my mom had a wonderful sister like you, and I got a wonderful aunt. So I hope you had a, have a wonderful time with your family and your friends, and I wish you a happy birthday. Bye. Hello, happy... Oh, bah. <laughs> Hello, Aunt Winona. This is your nephew, Alan, one of Flora's brood. Um, for the record, I'm next to the last, and I think she did better and better as the years went by. I'm sending you this video wishing you a happy 90th birthday um, here in my backyard in Bend, Oregon, where I think I might be retired. I haven't, I haven't really decided yet. And I hope that you are doing well and that you're enjoying life. Take care. Happy birthday, Aunt Winona. I'm sitting on the front porch of my home here in American Canyon. Um, perhaps you'll hear the chimes playing in the background. My dog, Jack, is on the floor beside me and I'm sitting in a hammock swing. Um, I wanted to wish you happy birthday um, this is your 90th, 
uh, somebody said to me, you're going to be having your uh, the mom um, momentous birthday coming up, aren't you? I said, 75? That's momentous? And I don't think it is. Perhaps 90 or 99. Anyway, happy birthday, and I hope you've had a good, a good few days. Happy birthday, Aunt Winona. It's so nice that you get to celebrate the 90th birthday and that you have your daughters around you. I know that that's a blessing, and Mama thought it was such a blessing to have up to half of her kids living nearby for a while and to have her three daughters close to her towards the end. And I also wanted to thank you for being such a good sister, a good loving sister, and making the effort to come out and see Mama those few times that you did that. I know that made her happy. I also wanted to thank you for all the work that you did in collecting our family history. Uh, that's been a treasure that I've opened uh, over the years, but not so much as I have in planning our trip to Nova Scotia in a few weeks. It's going to be a real a real privilege to be standing in front of houses that our ancestors we share a bloodline and gene pool with stand in front of the houses that they built there in Halifax and that's because of your hard work. I really appreciate that. Um, I spoke to you a couple of weeks ago about this trip and your mind was so crisp and I hope that you are feeling as well as it seems you're doing and that you will have a good birthday with your family. Love you. Bye. Hi, Aunt Winona. Happy birthday. I was thinking about uh, what I remember of you as a child. You're, of course, my mom's baby sister, along with Eloise. And I remember you as beautiful and fresh and vibrant. Um, how proud my mother was of your work uh, in life and what a good wife you were to your husband. I remember as a child going to your house and seeing it as beautifully appointed and carefully kept and well managed and full of, full of beauty in life. Um, I know you were so important to my mother. She loved all of her family dearly, especially her sisters. And I'm, uh, I've often taken as a template for my life with my sisters, the relationship that I saw my mother maintain with her own. So happy 90th and congratulations. You are part of my family history that I cite in terms of longevity and genuine good health, strong genes. I'm proud to claim you as a relative. I wish you the best for the coming year. May all your dreams come true. Happy birthday. Hey Aunt Winona, this is Bracken, Flora's son. I hope you have a wonderful 90th and that your coming year is full of happiness and uh, good times. I'm glad your daughters are with you and um, I hope you're having a wonderful birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday Aunt Winona. Winona. We, we love, love you. you. And wish you another fabulous trip around the sun. Hi Aunt Winona, it's your niece Adelaide from Soho Square in London. Just stopping in to say happy 90th birthday and I love you so much and I hope you have a wonderful day and a fantastic party. Love you.